He's doing pretty well. <laughs> Charlie seems remarkably talented, but there are still some things he can't do. <laughs> Song Pong thinks they have a kind of tacit agreement, each to help each other. They help him with his coconut plantation, but first he has to train them. Song Pong is also tutoring another monkey, and this one is quite promising. Advanced training. It's hardly the obvious thing to do, to twist a coconut while hanging from a branch. He's doing pretty well. Unlike most humans, Charlie has no fear of heights. For him, climbing a 25-meter palm tree is child's play. Things only get complicated once he's at the top. This is Charlie's special skill, collecting coconuts for his master. And it was Sompong who taught him. Mm. <laughs> It's the end of the working day. Charlie is in a hurry to go home. Charlie seems remarkably talented, but there are still some things he can't do. But how much work can a monkey really do? The factory pays a bit over $30 for every hundred coconuts. Deduct a few bananas and the annual visit to the vet, and the income gives Sompong a reasonable living. 
Charlie is Sompong's best pupil, so he certainly deserves this reward. Sompong knows that Charlie would probably prefer the forest to captivity. On the other hand, with Sompong, there is a plentiful supply of food. Sompong thinks they have a kind of tacit agreement, each to help each other. The work that Sompong and Charlie do together isn't so unusual in southern Thailand.